How's it going, comic book fans? So, I'm Joe from Joe's Comic Con. As you can see, I'm wearing my cool Batman shirt. So, that means I'm gonna, I got my DC pick out from my comic book shop. So, I did get Batman 125. I'll show that in, in a few minutes. But, uh, first one I want to show is, uh, Batman Neo, uh, Neo year. Uh, I did get cover issue four. This is so cool. I love Batman Beyond. So, the word of God, um, strikes. Um, and gave, and gave Terry a chance to leave, but he refused. So, uh, Terry's in kind of a battle with the bad guys and, uh, as Batman, but still, I, I love, I love Terry McGinnis as Batman because it takes place in, kind of in the future. I remember watching, uh, Batman Beyond, uh, in high school. And it, I thought it was such a cool, uh, show, cartoon at the time. So I, which is why I started collecting Batman Beyond because I, Love, love Batman Beyond is such a cool uh, series. So this is cover A, and then I also got cover B. So two different covers for this issue. So what did you guys um, get? Did you get either cover A or cover B? And uh, what's just your favorite? Uh, to me, I think cover A wouldn't sit in this one, but uh, everybody's different. So only two covers for uh, Batman Beyond this time. I don't get the the ratios because they are a bit too expensive and uh, my bill was already high enough as it was because my graded comments came in so uh key issue alert batman 125 uh first uh came appearance of failsafe so he's supposed to be a like a uh batman's now doomsday uh to as doomsday was to superman so we'll see how the story arc plays out will failsafe do what uh, Doomsday did to Superman, and maybe we'll get a new Batman eventually. I hope not. I love Bruce Wayne as Batman. So this is regular cover. So um, I I did get several different covers. So I'll show you guys uh what I get, and um, let me know what what you guys think is the best one. So I got I I got like I said I got quite a few covers. I got Batman and Robin overlooking the city. Um, pretty cool artwork. I, I give this uh, comic an 8 out of 10 um, because it, it is a key issue. The artwork is so good for Batman uh, right now. I'm just loving each uh, issue. And it is a first appearance, so that makes it all so special. And there's a Catwoman bat, uh, bat story in this. So that's so cool as well that Catwoman's in here. And that's why she's on a cover. So uh, like I said, I got several different covers uh for batman 125 i was not expecting uh to get so many covers but i did so i don't know what you guys uh got for batman 125 but i did uh, i did get most of the covers um i don't really like this cover it's not my favorite but i'll still put it in the box and uh keep it with the rest of my batman so new story arc on these uh, on the on this issue so that's what it's a key Key issue alert, Batman 125. Uh, this is another cool cover with uh, Batman and Robin on it. I know they're reinventing Robin, which I don't care for. I'm, I, I'm old school. I like old school Batman and Robin. So uh, that's just me. Because I, I grew up with old school movies like a lot of people my age. So I'm um, pretty cool. But I'll never stop collecting Batman just because Batman's so cool. With all his uh, special gadgets and everything that he has, even though in the Joker Wars, Wars he's uh, lost his match and, and all of that, but <clears throat> but you wouldn't think Batman would make that kind of mistake, but I guess he did along the way. So I also got a special cover for uh, Batman 125. Has, apparently, this is a more rare uh, cover. I got that Ashkin. Uh, I think that's how you pronounce it. This Crystal Clear cover, which is. Uh, so cool. I, I love I love this cover. I'm going to open it for you guys and show you guys um, what was it all about. It's just a, such a neat cover. I just wanted to take a minute and show you guys about it. See, th this is how clear, clear it is. It has its own page and it has this city. So that's so cool about this comic. It's uh, apparently a, a, like a, a special cover. So and uh, it's also it, on the inside, it has the Joker in it. So Batman's dealing with the Joker as well, which is quite, quite cool. So 
Uh, there's some cool Batman covers. So what is you guys' favorite? Um, did he happen to get this special clear cover one? I, I'm glad I did. Uh, it was in my file. So I was, again, was not expecting to get this one, but st still I'm very happy. I do get uh, special covers from time to time. So I'll just quickly re show you guys this. And so, so you guys see cover A, um, cover B, let's just say uh, cover C uh, with Catwoman. I think these two are going to be my favorite next to the clear one. Uh, cover D, even though I know it's not, not and cover E. So there you have it. some pretty cool uh, Batman covers that I got uh, this week. I did get the key issue. Uh, alert and I also got that uh, I believe it's called the Ashkin uh, Cover so it's so the value is going to go off on this one. So I would grab this while you guys can so um, I also got Joker 15. This is the last uh, One of this series. I don't know if they'll do a volume two, but it is a uh, pretty cool so the clown prince of crime ha had um, one more trick off his sleeve. So is this is final in, in this final issue did the joker gets his last laugh uh, uh commissioner gordon was uh hired to kill off the joker did he do it uh, i'll leave it up to you guys to uh read it so uh, i did get cover a i got cover b i i love this cover with him with his cell phone on it with the dc logo uh what do you guys think it is it is so cool and i got cover see with the joker and the snow globe with the uh uh the snow globe and the city is in in it so what did you guys think did you like this series i thought it was good um that they have tried to uh hire jim gordon to try and kill the joker but as always uh he is a good guy and he uh went against them and did not kill them so this is the uh, key issue for Batman 125. Uh, I just think it's so cool. And also, I wasn't going to show you, do you show this one, but I think I will anyways. I did get Spawn 331. Um, I elements of Spawn's uh, Dark Past comes to uh, rise, so he's facing friends and foe in the this current uh, story arc. I love Spawn. I think Spawn's so cool. It is. Uh, the artwork and the bright colors in here is really good. So I give it an 8 out of 10. It's not a key issue, but still, I've been collecting Spawn for a long, long time. So um, there you have it. I got some new DC comics in my file this week. So I, on Monday morning, I will uh, do a special Monday YouTube video. I got some graded comics, um, so, which was my, my bill was uh, really expensive. I got 5 out of 12 back. For greater comments, so I can't wait to show you guys uh, on Monday morning what I got. I uh, th these are uh, graded comics because uh, they're in the special cases. So Monday morning, I will show you guys what I got. I'm looking forward to it. I think I got some pretty high grades and some cool ones uh, to showcase for you guys. So, um, anyways, uh, for as always, hit like and subscribe to my channel, and I will. Um, and I'll be, uh, on, I'm also on TikTok, Instagram, and I'm on now Twitter at Joel's Comments Table. So, uh, thanks for watching. Um, so what, I'm just going to leave the question. What did you guys get? Did you get, um, Batman or anything else for DC this week? So let me know in the comments and we'll talk more about com comic books. Thanks everybody. Have a great day.